Hey pretty girls, it's Taylor. Welcome to Pretty Girls Love Me. Subscribe if you're not. Hey girl, hey. As you can tell from inside this video, we are going to just be doing like a little chit chat, watch me work type video. But before we get started, I want to just thank No Issue Custom Tissue Paper and Packaging for reaching out to me and giving me my first sponsored video. So I'm going to tell you all about their products first and then we're going to get into the video. So first things first, they are called No Issue eco packaging so basically they're a custom packaging brand they sent me over some stickers as you all can see these are one inch stickers and i think i got about 250 of these so y'all can see that and then they sent me over some postcards too so we're going to open it up it comes in like this cute little box it says no issue no issue on there and they are 100 percent recyclable so first things first, look at their packaging. It's so cute. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I already opened this up, so we're gonna just act like I didn't open it up and I'm gonna give y'all a reaction. Oh, let me turn it upside. Let me do it this way. Thumbnail. So I got, they sent me over 50, as you all can see, that's a lot, 50 custom packaging postcards. So first, my first impressions is these are very very big they are too big for my packaging but they are nice quality as you all can see it just has welcome to the pretty girls club thank you for shopping then they just have my website and then my instagram on there this packaging um this order came in about i think a week and a half so after because what they're gonna do is they're gonna like you know make your products for you then they're going to send you an email and you have to approve the proof first and then they're going to start production on your products so after you know i approve the the after i approve the design and stuff like that i think it came within like a week honestly like two or three days so they have fast shipping they're eco-friendly they're vegan like this custom packaging is so freaking cute as you all can see it's the size of my head it's so big and i think that this would be helpful like i didn't know that they're going to be this big if i would have known it was going to be this big i would have made it more so like a flyer and then that way i can like you know pass these out on the street it really wouldn't make sense to like pass these out on the street for me because it says welcome to the previous club but i also feel like it actually does make sense so instead of me using these for like my packaging like in my packages i'm going to actually like you know pass these out to people so just keep that in mind when you do order the postcards I think they had different dimensions, but it was on me to choose the size. And honestly, I didn't know what size to choose or what size was small enough because I think the, the measurements was in centimeters. So I just chose the one in the middle, honestly. So that's probably why I got such a big um, postcard. But definitely check out No Issue Custom Tissue Paper and Packaging. I'm going to leave their information on the screen somewhere on the screen um i'm gonna you know of course record a close-up for you all as well and i'm gonna just leave their instagram and their website on there so thank you to no issue custom tissue paper and packaging for reaching out to me and sponsoring your girl so don't forget to get your postcards get your stickers and just check them out okay y'all so i honestly don't even have a direction for this video we're gonna just see where this video goes um basically i could be doing like a lot of stuff like i could be making some more bangles to put on the website i could be making some basic bangles or i could be stuffing envelopes because i just got another batch of 250 envelopes in the mail yesterday so i need to you know put my business card in them and put my sticker on there and stuff like that so i think i might do that first i think i might i might do that first i don't have any business cards left y'all like i need to honestly y'all like this video just might just be like a chit chat honestly like, i just don't know i have so much stuff to get done like i need to order a whole bunch of new inventory i need to order business cards stickers packing slips like all shipping labels i mean shipping labels i just need to buy a whole bunch of new stuff for the summer like because summer is right around the corner is april 2nd at this point i think april 2nd is april 3rd then today's april 3rd so today's april 3rd and like summer is here like summer is here like summer was my best month y'all like last year in 2020 may was my best month in business like i had made sixteen thousand dollars in may 2020 so y'all already know that i have to get my life in order so i can make that plus more this year and this summer coming around like 
I just have so many goals, so much stuff to do. Um, as you all might or might not know, if you don't know, then you just hit subscribe so you can just be up to date. I am graduating with my master's degree in May, May 14th is when I graduate. Um, so that's like a little, a month and like a week at this point. And so I have to pack up this whole entire apartment I've been in. I'm going back home to my mom's house. Like I just have a lot of stuff going on y'all. Like honestly, I really do. I have a whole bunch of stuff going on all at once. And I just feel like I have a lot and nothing at the same time. So it's like I can be doing a lot of stuff, but a lot of stuff don't need to be done until a couple more weeks. So it's like I'm in like this stagnant little spot because I don't want to start packing right now because I have a whole another month to be here. You see what I'm saying? But then it's just like I do need to start thinking about packing, start thinking about what I'm keeping, what I'm taking, what I'm leaving, you know, what I'm throwing away, what I'm giving away. Like, so it's like a whole bunch of different type of plans that have to be made i don't even know y'all i'm rebel at this point but we're gonna just enjoy like this chit chat video i'm gonna just talk to y'all about a lot of stuff um like i said i get my business cards i can tell y'all i get my stuff from since we are here i get my business cards as you all know from vistaprint.com um i would just leave like you know vistaprint.com on what on the screen so I get my business cards from Vista Print. I think I get about five hundred for like twenty five dollars at this point. Yeah, I think it's like five hundred for like twenty five dollars. Like, it's not it's not really that much, but I'm starting to realize I need to order more than five hundred at a time because I'm running through those really quickly. Um, I actually I think I got a thousand this time because I think I ordered in January. Yeah, and these are the last few, and it's April, so. A thousand lasts me a pretty good while. So I get my this my business cards from Vista Print. I get my so when I like send promos like girls, like when I send like uh, Florence's packages or whatever, I send them like this little card. And the card just says, Welcome to the Pretty Girls Club. Thank you for working with us. Don't forget to tag us in your post. And then just have all my information right there. I get these cards from Canva. And Canva is pretty cheap too. Like, I don't know if y'all know, but you can order business cards and postcards and flyers, whatever you want from Canva. So like y'all know how like when y'all make y'all um when y'all make y'all uh you know flyers and stuff like Instagram or like your business cards, you can print directly from Canva. So that's that's really cool. And of course, like y'all already seen earlier, again, this is my no issue packaging and so these are going to just be what i'm going to be passing out to people on the street so um i was thinking about like when i go back home putting some in like people mailboxes putting some in people cars at the mall i think that i seen bougie barbie she did this last year when she walked around her local mall and just put all her like you know like a little cars on people cars so i think i might do that this summer as well um so yeah, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do that this summer. So again, this is from No Issue. Make sure you check them out. Um, what else? Oh, I get No Issue. They also like I already said at the beginning of the video. They do stickers. They do postcards. They do business cards. They do like the tissue paper. They do stamps. I think I want to get a stamp from them next. Like I definitely want to stamp so you can like you know stamp your boxes and stuff. Because as y'all already know that I'm trying to transition to boxes, but I just have not found my right type of box yet. Like, I, I had that one marble box from Amazon, but it just wasn't for me. It was too small. And then, like, the other Amazon boxes, just it just be only $25 for, like, $40. Like, I'm going to need more than that. And then custom boxes just cost so much. And just, like, it, do my products equal the amount I'm going to be spending on packaging. Like, I feel like if I do custom packaging, I'm going to be spending so much more money on packaging versus my product. Like, and it don't make sense for your packaging to, to be worth more than your products. You see what I'm saying? So it's just like, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I need to find somewhere that has like good quality boxes for like cheap. Maybe I'll go on AliExpress, but the only thing about AliExpress is it just takes too long to get here. So I'm just in like a real dilemma, honestly, about what kind of packaging I want to do next. Next, y'all already know, uh, my bubble mailers, I get those from Amazon, as you all can see, this is the order. I get my bubble mailers from Amazon. You can get your stickers from No Issue as well. They also, they offer different sizes. Um, 
they offer this is one inch these are one inch size so they're kind of small but you can get one inch three inch um however big you want and then as y'all already know i get my bangles and stuff from amazon and i will have my amazon link in the description box down below so y'all can just shop all my amazon bangles and my amazon charms that y'all get from amazon as well so i just got these from amazon I get those from Amazon as well. Like y'all already know, my shipping label and the shipping label, like the shipping labels and like the Dymo printers from Amazon as well. I honestly don't know how this video turns into like um, supplies, but hey, we're here. Uh, what else? Oh, this drill, like y'all kill me about this drill. This drill comes from Amazon. Like y'all, Amazon has everything. Like, read between the lines. Like, Amazon has everything. Like, you can look up everything. So, this is a hand drill. I will have it in my description box as well. This is the hand drill. This is how I make my planner charms. I'm going to show y'all that. It comes with, you know, the actual drill. And then it comes like a green battery. You just drop it in there and close it up. Just twist it. Twist it on. Put it on. Y'all hear that? So it's on. Then you turn it off. So you click that button right there. So basically, what you do is you're gonna use Drake. I wanna show y'all. So all you do is click it. And see now you got a hole. Y'all see the hole? Is right there. Maybe y'all can't even see it, but you just drill and make holes in your planners. And then you have no charm. Like, so all you need is planner charms. Um, just Google planner charms. Like, y'all, just Google planner charms. I'm telling y'all, this is like free game. Like, just Google planner charms, custom planner charms, um, girly planner charms. You can just type in like those type of phrases, like, you know, cute planner charms or whatever. And I'm guaranteeing you're gonna find what you're looking for. So all you need is planner charms and then you just need your hand drill. And then you just create the holes like that. I might insert a clip as I'm talking of like, you know, me actually doing it. But if y'all follow me on TikTok or Instagram, y'all don't see me do this a hundred times already. So it's really no need to really explain like how to make planner charms but i could maybe do a different video but i just feel like it'll be kind of boring um i don't know and then you know as you all know you can get charms from almost anywhere i will have my charm vendor link which is going to be amazon in the description box as well you can get a lot of charms from amazon you can get your i started with amazon charms like it's, it's no secret it's no secret um just click the link in my description box and i will just show you all everything that i use when i first started my business um amazon amazon i use amazon first and then you know as my business grew and as i started to do more research i started to find you know more of like the cute aesthetic charms but for the most part you can just start off with amazon um i have my camera as well i don't know honestly y'all i did a review on this camera but this camera is just not giving what i wanted to give at all like i'm just gonna be honest i'm using my phone right now because my phone quality is just better like it's not the worst quality, but just not the best. It's just not giving what I wanted to give. So I think I'm going to take this camera to the pawn shop because I'm so mad. I spent $400 on this um, camera. So I'm going to take it to the pawn shop, see what they can give me for it. And then I'm going to go and buy me a battery camera. So that way, like for the summer and like for when I transition and move for real, I will be set. Um, I think I'm going to get, because this is the Canon H. The Canon SX730 HS Power Shot or whatever. It's not really it. So I think I'm gonna get the Canon G, the Canon, I think it's called G7X, something like that. Whatever it's called. I wanna get that camera because this camera is just not working. So I guess um what else? What other things do I use for my business that I can tell y'all? Um oh these little things. Like y'all ask about these every single time this is just a shirt tag and i got it from avery so all you do is just type in custom shirt tags like you know how when you order stuff and you can like you whatever 
just it's a shirt tag and you can just you can use your stickers like people are don't y'all just don't y'all want everything that everyone else got when y'all already got stuff if you have stickers you can use your sticker like i you can just use a regular sticker and just use that like you don't have to get this exact shirt tag because i got the exact shirt tag you see what i'm saying like the sticker and the shirt tag it don't really make a difference like it's all still the same thing and i feel like if you're just being honest, no one was really using tags in their bangle pictures until I started using them last summer. Like, I'm just gonna be honest. Like, y'all can disagree with me in the comments if y'all want to, but that's just how I feel. And I was just, I started to use them because I want to like stand out. And people know when they see that big pink circle, they already know it's pretty girl bangles, period. So it's just like now nah, everybody wanted to just use tags and stuff too. But it's whatever. Like, you know, being a trendsetter is being a trendsetter. Like, it's really, it's really whatever at this point. Like, I used to like last year, y'all, like, let me tell y'all this is just like a chit chat a random rant at this point um last year i used to get so mad when we used to do, do the stuff that i did or make the same type of captions i made but now like this year like i've matured so much with them business like and it's really real like business maturity is a thing like i really matured so much in business like um i used to get mad i used to get upset but now i don't even care no more like everyone has someone they look up to everyone someone has to be first you see what i'm saying like someone has to be first like everyone can be second so someone has to be first and i just feel like i really bear first for like a lot of stuff as far as the style and the way i talk and the way i make captions like for example i did the how to spice up your bagel when it's not selling picture and now everyone does it and now i did the gold versus silver now everyone does it I did the bling versus basic. Now everyone doing it. Like it, 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 it do. It, you know, it irritates me sometimes. But other than that, at this point, I don't really care no more because it's just like someone has to be first. Someone has to think of. It. I'm not saying that I created all these ideas, but I'm saying as far as for the bangle world, I wasn't seeing none of this until I started doing it. And and, and it really take practice. Like you really have to talk to yourself and be like, you know what, like. Just because they doing it after me don't mean it's taking away from my money. Because trust me, it's not taking away from my money and my sales at all. Like, it's billions of people in this world. And there's millions of people in America. So, everyone can eat. You know what I'm saying? Like, everyone can, can make bagels. Everyone can, can make money. So, it's just like, as long as it's not affecting you directly, then don't even worry about it. And I have to just keep, I keep telling myself that, you know, as I get older in business, like, your business is not hurting because she doing the same thing you're doing. Your business is not hurting because she made the same post you made. You see what I'm saying? So as long as your business is not hurting from it, don't even worry about it. And I know it's easier said than done because trust me, it took it has taken me a year to get to this point. And I'm actually shocked that I'm actually saying this type of stuff. But trust me, like you will you will understand more. Like once your sales start coming every day, like I make sales every single day. Once your sales start coming every day people know you you know what i'm saying like people are gonna know your brand people are gonna know your type of style like people are gonna know who you are so you don't have to worry about what other people are doing because if you focus on your grass your grass gonna remain green the minute you take your head off your grass it's all against someone else's plate your grass is gonna die so just keep watering your grass don't worry about what other people are doing over there or over here or above or below you just worry about what you got going on and trust me your business will never suffer like and my business is not suffering at all so it's just like and i just be so thankful because it's just like you just never know where it's gonna go like i tell my my mom this all the time and like people i talk to like i literally started my business in 2019 november 2019 like i was so sad i was heartbroken y'all like i was i was so sad that, that when i launched my business but it really grew overnight like my business blew up by march i had ten thousand followers so my business really blew up overnight and it's taken me to different experiences. I've met different people. I've learned a lot about myself. Like I said, I matured a lot, like all because of my business. So so I just be so thankful. Like I be thankful every day that people choose to shop with me, that God send people my way. Like people are really trusting me with their money. And it's just like I wanna just make sure that every day in business I put my best foot forward. But I'm gonna stop rambling right now because I don't even know how this video even turns into that type of motivational video. But it was just on my heart just to get this out and just let you all know, like, don't worry about what other people are doing. Like, 
just focus on yourself you know like it's okay to have like goals or people you want to be like but just don't compare yourself to someone else because like your journey and their journey is two different things and like when i started my business i didn't want to be like nobody but myself it wasn't even nobody for me to even look up to in the bangle business world if we be honest like so i just really started this I didn't really know nobody in the bangle business world um didn't have nothing to compare it to look up to nothing i just started doing my own thing and i'm here today so i'm very excited i'm almost at 50,000 followers if y'all seen this video most likely i'm not at 50k yet but i will be at 50k soon like i'm speaking that into existence like i will be at 50k soon like before the end of april i'll be at 50k like that is my ultimate goal 50k and of course 100k like who don't want to hit 100k but to hit 50k in a year and a half like this is gonna be major so i'm so excited um if you stay till the end of this video you are a real pretty girl hey girl hey and i'm gonna wrap it up here so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you all in my next video bye